More than 40,000 students nationwide are left with a lot of questions after a for-profit college closes its doors permanently. News Channel 5's Jonquil Newland is at the Nashville campus. Jonquil, why have they shut down? Well, Vicki, ITT Tech's parent company says it can no longer stay open since the U.S. Department of Education banned for-profit colleges from enrolling students who receive federal aid. Now, nationwide, the school employs about 8,000 employees with about 43,000 students enrolled. This morning, those students received a letter stating the school was closed and future classes were, classes were canceled for good. The letter also went on to give them information about how they could find out if their student loans could be discharged. Now, many students we spoke to today tell me they took out between twenty and hundred thousand dollars in school loans for a degree they now believe is worthless. While the federal government is cracking down on for-profit colleges, ITT Tech says it believes the government's action to keep for-profit colleges from enrolling students with federal aid is inappropriate and unconstitutional. However, a former teacher says it will help keep students like Chris McCarty from being scammed. It's a hard thing to try to try to swallow right now. You yeah. know, I was trying to better my trying to better my life and my kids' education. Yeah, trying to make, make better for them in their future. Now, the Tennessee Higher Education Commission is reaching out to the nearly 2,000 students across Tennessee to help them. The next quarter of classes were set to begin on September 12th, but of course, they are now all canceled. Live in Donaldson, I'm Jonquil Newland, News Channel 5.